Welcome back everyone to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Today we have still a lot on our plate. Still a lot on our plate. What we need to do, um, I'll show you quickly. I went and got all the dinosaur bones for this of fate. So we need to go and uh, send them all. So we got all of them to Deborah Martinez. Then we're gonna go and get our safe build. So we're gonna do the veteran mission. Uh, I think we need to go see Charlotte Balfour and uh, there's a treasure that we want to get and there's another special knife, the vampire knife that we want to get. So first thing first, we're going to go to, I think, Emerald Ranch so we can go to Arcade's Run and set our bones location. So I'll see you all at Emerald Ranch. So we made it to Emerald Ranch. We just need to go Whoa. and send our dinosaur bone. Then I think it's gonna take like a while before we receive the invite. So then we can uh, go to Ocre's run. Come on, John. All right, oh. All right, oh. Have a nice see you again, sir. Send mail. What you need to send? All of them. I'll be sure it gets to the right folk. Easy, easy. Ah, uh, you, you don't see them pop up. Log updated. So, so what do we have? Send that collateral road. Yeah. I think we need to receive a letter from that. You have mail at the, after at least twenty four hours. Yeah, because I don't think we can receive mail. There's oh. no nothing Hello there. Again. No, we can't right now. Good, good, good. So to go. The veteran mission doesn't appear on the map unless you're really close to it. But we know the first one, I think it's like Charlotte Balfour. We we'll need to go back there, but anyway. I think the first one is somewhere over there. So we'll go there. And I think it's a first step mission. And between each leg of the mission, we need to wait like 24 hours or something like that. It's a fun mission. And at the end, we get a Buell. I don't remember what race is Buell. I know it's a golden horse, but I don't remember which one it is. So you can do that mission as Archer, of course. I think in chapter six, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, but. If you do it, you dead build, you have it for one chapter, and then when you go to the epilogue, then you do because you lost your horse. Because you lose all your horses when you become John Maston, which is a bit of pain. I think there's a trick to still have it, like kind of a glitch kind of thing, but I've never tried it. So see, now it appears on the map, because we're close enough. Oh, look, look, I wasn't far off. I wasn't far off. So we're just gonna go there. Thank you. Well, I don't know why I put a waypoint since I know exactly where I'm going. Uh, maybe we're gonna wait until it's daytime. So I'm gonna sleep quickly and come back when it's daytime. So here we go. We waited until it's daytime and now we're ready to go. Hey! You there? Can you help? Them right can you help me, mister? What's the problem? My goddamn horse got spooked and run off. You hurt? Not too bad, at least. But he took my damn leg. Oh, yeah. Sorry. He went that way, I think. His name's Buell. Buell? Second time a prick named Buell cost me a leg. Huh? Buell was my general when I lost it. Okay. Anyway, if you see an angry bastard of a horse with my wooden leg, I'd be real grateful. I'll bear that in mind. I'll bear that in mind. Johnny is, doesn't look too happy to help at all. I think the horse is not too far, so we don't need to jump on ours. Uh, yeah, it's just over there. Just over there. Come on, John boy. How, how did you fall there? Okay. There he is. I think we need to calm it down, maybe. 
so it doesn't run away. Can't seem to be able to focus. Yes, study behold. Calm. Show in full. Ah, uh, Dutch one blood. Yeah. They're calm you down. Okay. Okay. There you go. It's all right. Easy. Creamy logo. Yes, some good start. Easy now. There, there. There you go. Hey. Come with us. Touch your butt, you master. Come on, then. Let's get you back. Look, I like Buell. It's a good horse. I just never was a fan of the the color. He's just where you but, left. You know. Can't go far with that leg in your stirrup. Can't go bucking him like that. So, you better be good, you hear? I get the notion he's not a man you want to cross. No matter yeah, how big not. and strong you are. So from what I know, there's no other way to get uh, a bugle. If you want a Dutch one blood criminal gold, then this one. So that's kind of the unique horse from the mission. Doing it as John means you can have it for the whole epilogue. You can get it like, as soon as you start the epilogue if you want to. But since you get it late for outer, then you lose it. It can be a bit uh, a shame if you want to, to get it. Depends what you're you gonna use it for. I feel like don't touch one blood are pretty good for a bit of everything. But it just doesn't fit. We ain't far now. Doesn't fit John. You here. Come on. Do you know what I mean? You're not so nasty. But hey, that's me. It's a cool horse because it's unique. So if you love it, but it's always cool to love it in your stable. You're a good man, Mr. Mr. John, you're right. He's a brute. <sighs> Hamish Sinclair. Yeah, he's a great horse. Aside from when the devil got him. Hey, you wanna hand me that leg there, please? And while you're at it, give old Buell a kick for me, would you? No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Were him but a snake that spooked him. <clears throat> you're a real gentleman, you know? Sometimes, maybe. Yeah, sometimes. How'd you lose the leg again? Oh, in the war. Cannonball. Pretty clean, though. I don't have much pain, and I didn't get any gangrene. A young boy went into battle with me. Got cut in half, so all things considered, I'm doing pretty well, I guess. Yeah. I guess so. How's the false one? It's okay. I can still hunt, fish, enjoy the outside. Weren't sent too crazy by it. Anyway, I ain't got much to pay you with. You know, we don't need money. It's okay. You like fishing? You can come with me someday. I know some pretty good spots. I'm a pretty poor fisherman. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm great. So between the two of us, we do okay. My cabin is right over on the other side of a craze run there. Thanks again. Man, you throw me again, you old dumb bastard. I'm going to put a bullet in you. I'll see you again. See you, Amish. Mission complete. So that's it, we've done the first one. So we need to wait 24 hours to be able to uh, go back and fish with him. So now what we need to do, we go receive our letter from uh, Deborah McDinnis. So we need to go back to Emerald Station, get that letter. So I see you all over there. Here we are. Adam Royal Ranch once again. And it's raining. Like the I feel the weather in the epilogue is changing like all the time really quick. I can't seem to have like one really good day. It's always gonna rain. Scroll statue arrived today. Thank you. Is that it? I thought we were getting a letter to go see her. Let's look at the satchel. No, we don't have a letter, do we? Is that the letter? Telegram from the city, no. That's it. We can't even look at it. So, that's what we got. So now, 
There will be a lot of like back and forth, fast travel in this uh, in this episode. We're gonna go uh, to Annesbird and see Charlotte Balfour. I think there's still a mission we can do with her because I don't think we finished it. You just left. So, right? yeah, yeah. So we're gonna do that quickly, and uh, I see you all over there. I don't think she's here. Maybe she is, but there's no mission. Let's see. See, it's already looking better. Oh yeah, we can. Hello there. Can I help you? I think you knew a friend of mine. A fella called Arthur Morgan. Came by and helped you with some hunting and skinning probably seven or eight years back. Yes, of course. Well, I wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for him. Unfortunately, he passed soon after. I figured he might not have had long left. Such a shame. He found me at my lowest point and he lifted me up. Glad to see you're doing well, ma'am. He wrote fondly of you. Oh, I couldn't be happier. Listen, it, it's a long way out here. You're welcome to take whatever you need from the house for your travel. No, no, that ain't necessary. Please, I have everything I need and more. But he gave me the ability to survive. And now I'm writing. Any friend of Arthur's is a friend of mine. Please take something. It would make me happy. She's really well, weird. That's very kind of you, ma'am. So what that is, you go in my house and take whatever you want. Uh, there's nothing that we really want, to be honest with you, uh, or need. But we'll take, uh, well, yeah, we'll take the cigarette or smoking is bad for her. And uh, at least we can say we took something so that makes her happy. But you don't have to take anything. And then we can say goodbye. You take care of yourself out here, ma'am. And she ignores us, right. So now the next step is uh, there's two things we can do. There's plenty of things we can do. Um, I think we're gonna go and do the second Amish mission. So by the time we get there, it should pop up. So I see you all. Did, what did I hear? A moose. I knew it. Western. Ah, uh, it's a two stars. So I see you all at a press run. So on our way to a press run, we receive some parcel or letter. So we can go and grab this one. I think this one is the invite to Deborah McGuinness. Let's see. Welcome back. Welcome back. Receive mail. Invitation, yeah. Thank you. Inspect document. Read. The Totalisaurus is completed. I was right. Yeah, please it's me. Fire would rise in Cumberland Forest. Deborah Medinus. Cool. We'll do that uh, after doing the Thanks second leg of the veteran. So we're going to a cross run. I see you all at Hamish. So we made it to the veteran house. Now you can see uh, Emish is here. So it's here on the map. If you've never been, it's like that little shack over there in Okres Run. You probably went and looted it in chapter two or three. I think we went. It was a while ago, but now it's here. If you see Buell, you know the mission is open. So you can just go in, I think, or knock on the door. Knock on the door. Hamish! John! Well, come in! You said we might go fishing. <laughs> Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go in my boat. Sure. Here she is. And you mind the rowing? weather is good. Sure. <laughs> what are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Mean as hell, Northern Pike. 
eats everything else that spawns around here, its own kind included. Is that our bait then? A, a jack or something? Hell no. He's a clever old bastard. I made these. This one's mine. You're gonna have to spare. Oh, they're pretty. You don't Beautiful. know the half of it. <laughs> Come on, let's push off. I'll show you where we're rowing to. Here we go. So John can't swim. So whatever we do, we'll set up ten yards or so offshore. Uh, we can't fall in the water. You don't keep far away from me, the tyrant. Wants me to know whose lake it is. Oh, we'll show him who's boss. <laughs> the optimism of youth. Right touch here. the legendary northern we'll pirate. cast off towards the island. Okay. Let's see if we can touch it. I gave you? Yeah. Got it. I spent years working on that. Finding the right combination of feathers, twine, and glimmer. Making them, losing them, getting them right. I tried coins, shell cases, even a metal. Finally found something he seems to like. And now I hear you can buy him in a shop. Wouldn't be quite so satisfying getting him with something shop bought. Easy for you to say. <laughs> but maybe I'm inclined to agree. I can't see any fish. There's an art here to come. Does one come in? Maybe not. Okay. Well, with that in, we try right in front of us. So oh, what's this? Hey, you got something? I got something, all right. <laughs> oh, I don't like that music. Hey, you need? Come on now, tyrant! I got you. I got you. Come on. Amish, I'm not sure what's ah, good. Ah, ah, went off slack. Went off slack. Come back. No, oh, it's a drop back. Uh oh. Amish. <laughs> Amish. Uh, I like when Johnny's just stitching the face. All right, Amish. Stay there. there. I'll roll out to you. Real quick. Bastard just bumped me. Over here! Don't you worry, Mitch. We'll save you once again. Can you climb up? Oh, good. Because I ain't going in the water. John didn't say, but you can't Come on up here. There you okay. go. Okay. You lost anything? It's just my rod. Would have gotten my toes too. They weren't wooden. <laughs> you want another go, Adam? I still got my lure. Nah. He's your fish now. Cast away. Or do I need to fish still? We'll come at him from the other way. Row over there. All right. When he bumped me, I had to check twice. Thought I'd find a chunk of me missing. Man, he's <laughs> like. That would be a first. I'm not so sure. Okay, right here. Our hopes of catching this bastard lie with you. Cast oh back boy. to where we were, and make sure to use that lure I gave you. Here we go. That him? I think nah. I hooked him. Real. Let's land the bastard. It doesn't look like a legendary. Here we go. Wait! Don't it's reel oh. while he's thrashing like that! Yeah, it's fighting. Start reeling. Stand steady. Yes. I don't think that's a legendary fish. Normally they're making bigger waves. It's a big fish, yeah, but I'm not sure it's the tyrant. Strong, ain't he? Yeah. Time to reel. Yeah, I'm doing it, Amish. Come on! Come on! Get in, 
in now. Yes. I'm trying. I'm trying, Imish. Oh, man. Don't let him pull you. Reel it in. Oh, that's a tough one. We got you now, Tyrant. We got you now. Do we? I feel the line's not a bright anytime soon. I'm tiring all right here. All right. Uh, I don't think we make any good. progress. He's drawing really slow. Oh, dear. Here we go. Thank you very much. That was a tough one. Oh, it's a big one too. But that's not that one. Damn you, tired. I'm sorry. Sorry for. You caught him. Ready? I don't think it is. The tyrant. Let's roll back. It was a tough one. I don't have that much trouble with the legendary fish. Normally they're pretty easy. Here, here. Oh, the holder. <sighs> Pass me the tyrant. That is, if you're sure you don't want him. <laughs> I'll make a from the pond. Well, I'll give him his honors then. He sure was something, huh? Yeah. He was. Thanks for taking me out. I appreciate the company. That's one hell of a fish. Ain't he something? So long. Hey, you ever want to go out hunting? You stop by again. I may. By me, we will. So was it really the... The gentle refuge? Let's look at the map. I said, let's look at the map. Because I know that... Is there a legendary refuge in Ocras Run? I thought there was. Maybe not. I don't remember exactly where they are. Anyway, that is done. After that much effort. Now we're gonna go and see uh, Deborah McDinnis. So I see you all in the Cumberland's Forest. So here we are, we made it to the Cumberland Forest. It happens on your map, Fire Rise, so you don't have to worry about it. Once you get the invite, it's gonna pop up. It's not like Amish that you need to be close by or, or whatnot. And this, like finding all the bones is pretty, look, it's a bit of a grind, not gonna lie. We have a video on the channel, so you can uh, go and see all the locations. The good thing is that they appear on the map once you find them. 
So I'll show you quickly. You don't have a bone like that, so you know which one you found and which one uh, you're missing. So if you follow the diet on the channel, we have like a good route too. We try to make a good route to find them all, but you need to be in the pillar because some of them are in your stand. And then you need to do it to get, uh, if you want to do 100% completion, you need to do the bones and then you're gonna get a, a special weapon afterwards. So here we go. Hello there. Who Hello. You? I'm a friend of Arthur's. He passed a few years back, unfortunately. Oh, uh, sorry to hear that. I've been sending you the bones since then. Oh, I wondered why there was such a hiatus. Well, come in, come in. I cannot wait to show you the fruits of your labor. You'll be quite amazed. I was right, of course. Quite right. <laughs> Were you now? <laughs> okay. Lovely to see you. Here. Just as I thought. Totalosaurus West, Elizabethus. The Elizabethan Megasaur. That's uh, quite a monster. <laughs> oh, 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 it'll change everything. It's incredible. Tail. Fins for swimming. Three pairs of legs so we could run extra fast, even in mud. Even in Large mud. Large tusks for doing tusky type things and long spines that acted as wings they said i was a fool a silly old woman <laughs> i was right all along oh this is the happiest day since well since my sister died but that's Whoa. another story thank you i will of course share the credit oh that that's okay. I like to keep a low profile. Really? Yeah. I must give you something. Something valuable. I... Yeah, we don't want Here, to be associated with that. Here, take this. The handle is genuine stegosaurus bone. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> All the best. The same to you, sir. Same to you. So we got a knife and a mission complete. So that's one more tin completed for. Uh, it's not in there. Can we have a look at it? I don't remember where it goes. Dinosaur bone. Old. Jabon knife. Jabon knife. That's what it is. Uh, yeah, I think it might go into your locker or it goes on your horse or something like that if you can't find it. Or maybe it goes somewhere else. No, those are all the Troy balls. So it should be somewhere over there. Hunting knife, hatchet, stone hatchet, fighting hatchet, you will not shed. Oh, okay, so you go there, knife, hunting knife. Come on, Jono. Hunting knife. Jabon knife, and then we have John's knife. So let's can we have a look. Yeah, we can't really inspect it, can we? Well, it's there. Anyway, it's there. So now, what we need to do? One more time, boy. We're gonna go and sleep and go and do the next image. Mission. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do because we're close by and then we're gonna go to Saint Denis for the or Ornette Dagger. So I see you all at Amish. And we are back. Our quest run. Let's go hunt with Amish. Hello, Buell. I think it's the last one. I might be wrong, but we'll see. Amish, it's done. John Marston or Milton. Hey, Mish. John, come in. <laughs> so, you said we might go out on a hunt? I did. 
There's this huge she-wolf been stalking me the last few nights I've been out, but she can wait. <laughs> Let's talk a while. Sure. Thanks. So what do you do? Me? Uh, I'm a wanderer. Farmer. <laughs> I was born further north, spent a lot of time out west. Funny, I never saw myself as a wanderer, man. What just happened? The bodies lay so thick, they could have oh. walked across the whole okay. field without your boots touching mud. Those were bad times. Mm. Yes, they were. Would you like some more coffee? Mm. Please. I didn't step anything. I would have listened to the whole convo. What have we here? Yeah. She's right across there. That close. Oh, ho, 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 ho. she's acting brazen. Come on. Let's mount up. Let's mount up. Come on. She went around to the left. Around the lake. She's down right. here somewhere. Let's just make sure we have uh, some weapon with us. Because if I remember well. Keep up. Get her while she's here. Wolf. Wolf shouldn't come so close to people. Yeah, it's strange. When the whole country was wild, they could go where they liked. Now they're stuck hiding in the few corners of wilderness we got left. It's a feeling with which I can sympathize. This ain't a country for wild animals, nor wild men neither. Not anymore, you hear that? it seems. Yep. Quickly now. This way. Okay, I didn't hear anything. Up there! On the outcrop, you see her? Yeah. Let's go around it. Okay, I'm with you. I'm with you. We're here. on sure. to her. Come on. Okay. I'm, I'm going to you, Pete. So. I can't see her. Let's get up to the top. Have a look around from up there. View loves hills, don't you, boy? You eat them up for breakfast. Easy. What we got here? Is that a fresh kill? Could be. Is the blood set? Let me take a look. What do you think, Mish? Yep. That was her dinner. So what now? Now where'd she get to? Following you. My guess. She's gone somewhere over there. <laughs> There's a whole lot over there. That's the problem. <laughs> uh, that was a good one, is. Got shy all of a sudden. You got some extra miles in you tonight. If we gotta chase her, let's chase her. Oh all Jesus, right. already on your horse. Amish. Not wasting a second. Not on the mini map anymore. Damn it! Too slow! It looks like she's headed into the wood. We're gonna have to track her through the scrub. Better to be on foot. Send your horse you somewhere sure? safe. You're going, boy. There's a wolf about. You went in there, all right. We got a tracker. Now you want to take the lead, or shall I? Uh, I can take the lead. If you don't mind, I'd like to. Okay. Get. Tr there you go. I'll be close behind you. Sure enough, I don't like it. I feel we're done a dead jump. Got the trail. This way. Take it slow. See anything yet? Just tracks. Down here? Yeah, down here. We don't get her. What's the worst that can happen? She runs off with a chicken? Well, I'm fine with losing chickens. But I lost a leg. Oh, there it is. Hey. 
Up there. Is that the she wolf? I don't know. Ah oui, tu l'es né? Oh boy! We've walked into something here! Oh boy, I wasn't ready for that. Oh boy. One dead. Two dead. Three dead. Four dead. Whoa. You alright? I was ready to offer my complete and unconditional. I don't think the wolves would have showed much mercy. That's quite an ambush she let us into. A bushwhacking, I'd call it. Huh? Where is it? God damn! Over here! Over here! Uh Whoa, of course it's coming for us. Break free. Come on. You alright? Yeah. Damn. Damn. Big son of a bitch. Is that all of them? That's the best of them. Look at them. Proud thing. Scary thing. <laughs> they brought us up here to be slaughtered. You were after a hunt? Yeah. Guess I got hunted. <laughs> you going back to the cabin? Yeah, nah. Still early. We'll stay up here a while. Dress this animal. I won't likely see another like him for some time. I hope I won't either. <laughs> Thanks for taking me out. Yeah, anytime. You want to go out again? Yeah. You come by and see me. So long, man. Yeah. Wait. So long. Here's a pelt. Thank you. Uh, you earned it. So long. Yeah. So long. Perfect wool path. Oh, just a good one. Ah. All right. Fair enough. So the next thing we want to do now, that this is done, is go dead or save the ornate dagger. And for that, we need to go to Saint Denis. So it's kind of a like treasure hunt kind of thing. So I'll show you all how it goes when we get to Saint Denis. So we made it to Saint Denis. I will show you where we are on the map for the first clue. So right here, just above the end of Saint Denis. So we have like, I think four or five clues to that. And then we can inspect it. I've never done it with John, so I don't know where it's gonna go. So if you walk over there and there's that big white door, you can see the first clue. So we can inspect that. And John is supposed to write it on his journal. Here we go. So the next clue is not too far. We can all do it on foot. It's somewhere over there. So they're all around here. And then we can find him. So uh, let's go and find the other clue, I think, yeah. So if you open, so you have the market right here. If you open that gate, and it's right there, inspect it. Should be good to go. Thank you. The next one is in the, the other market. I think it's somewhere over there. I think it's closer to the general store than the... Did I hear a pig? Morning. Morning. Okay, so we can go on foot. Run, run, run. Yeah, having all the clues, it's, it's more of a poem than anything else. But then he will uh, draw a map. Well, Archer was drawing a map on his, uh, in his journal and he was pinpointing. So if I remember Look right, out. that way. Oh yeah, it's right here. On that wall, inspect. Here we go. One more. So the next one 
It's not too far off if we continue. I think it's somewhere over there near the transmit. So we can go there. And then for once we get the, the whole thing done, well, we need to wait until I think midnight or the middle of the night to find the vampire because of course they don't come out during the day. Let's not get into trouble, John. Thank you very much. This one is under that yellow sign. Electric work of all kinds. So if we go there, oh, I can't see anything. Uh, if I remember well, it's under the stairs. If we go there and then it's on the right on the wall. Yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad. Inspect this one. And then we can go for the last one. Should not be too far. So if we look on the map, I think it's just somewhere over there, the next door. Next door, so if it could be a bit less dark. So we go there and I think it's near the transmit. Where is it? It's another alleyway. All right, so Jet Dragon Chinese restaurant. That's where it is. Just go down. I was trying to find that, that alleyway, and then we can just go in there. And I think it's somewhere there. Can I see it in the light? Oh, it's right here. Inspect. It was so dark, I could not even see the alleyway. I think this is the last one. Yeah. So then it triangulates over there and now we need to wait until uh, midnight and we can go and chase it. It will be not too We're far from to here. Galveston. So here we are. We waited until midnight and then you have that heads that crops on there. So we're gonna go and normally that's where we have our vampire. So it's not too far down from the gunsmith where we were. But we'll pop up just after uh, midnight. So if you Look where you're going. go there, make sure you have your guns at the ready because it can kill you quite easily. Go there. Here you go. So, you found me. <laughs> <laughs> So creepy. Hey, what are you doing? Stay back for your own sake. I walk with the undead. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> what, you're a vampire? I have been called many names over the centuries. Now go, or I'll feed on you too. Will you? You're a goddamn idiot. <laughs> I'll suck you dry. Do you? Yeah, so you have to go fast because it can kill you. It jumps on you and it will kill you in one shot. So now you can get the honored dagger. Did we pick up the honored dagger? Pick up. Here you go, on a dagger. So you need it for the compendium, for the 100% completion. Nice, nice, nice. So that's one more done. So we still have some of them that we need to go and uh, buy and find. Some of them are in the wild, in the wild in nature or whatever. Some of them we need to craft and some of them we need to still buy from uh, from the weapon shop so we're not done there yet it's gonna be like a, a cleanup job that we need to go and do uh, at the end of it, of it all so now we're gonna go back to see image for what i think will be the last the last one no, no, no. Oh, no. your money mister now 
Hey. What are you starting over? Here, have this for my gratitude. Please. Stranger. No, I ah, can't. Keep it. You be careful now. Sound yeah. and ease, I don't know what we did because we could not see anything. I was just trying to hurt him, but let's go. So I see you all at image now. And we're back at the veterans homestead. Back with image. I think this one is the last one. I'm pretty sure it is. Or was. I know I said the same thing with the previous mission. I think we're gonna hunt and yeah, the hey, Mr. Four. I'm not sure that. Come on in. So, how you keeping out here? Ah, keeping fine, thank you. It's all right then, is it? Living out here, away from civilization. <laughs> civilization. Yeah, I saw what civilization and industrial advancement will get you into war. Progress, well, it ain't always progress. Besides, I ain't lonely up here. I got company. Yeah, I guess. Come look at these. Remember catching that? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I do. I know you ain't forgot about him. Oh, I still see him in my dreams. Yeah, I got the whole of nature up here. And I'm going to make the most of it, as long as there still is some. Whoa. They weren't lying. What's this? Right there by the outhouse. Look at the size of that boar. Holy hell. That's a lot of I bigger. saw some cattle gourd the other day, but I didn't think it was possible. Let's go take care of it. Okay. Damn, I thought I got him. Pursue. I'll grab the mounts. All right, pursue. Connect him from there. I don't Stop know there. much. God damn. Stop Come on, John. Yeah, I don't think he is gonna listen to us saying stuff. Yep. Not sure why you would climb on that rock, but uh, I wish I had more of a rifle and my Lancaster. As much as I love Lancaster. Giant boar. Yeah, that's not a restroom at all. I got the horses. Come on. Here, Here we go, go, boy. Oh, is it going over there? Did I lost sight of him. Don't worry. Traps go this way. Come on. It's fast, too. Yeah. yeah, but we'll get him. He came through here, all right. So now I can get something a bit better. Yeah, the bolt action will do. So we don't have to reload and be shot. Uh, can you grab it just in case? Uh, I would not go. He's been across here twice. What do we do? Well, he's been up this hill to the right and down this one in front of us. But I can't tell which tracks is fresher. Let's split up. You go up and I'll go onwards. Okay. Good luck to you, sir. Yeah. Come on, Bew. I thought Bew like elves. So why am I the one doing up Okay, so the thing like with hunting boar on a horse back is that the boar might attack your horse, so that's why we'll not do it. That's for clue. Oh the truck is there. Oh it killed the wolf. What's that? Inspect. It better be dead. Gold. Gorn wolves, too. Damn it. Oh, yeah. I think Amish got him. Oh, found him. Amish! Shit. He's after him. Oh yes, yeah. Come on, horse. Uh, 
I scrub our own meat. I don't know why. That music is, <laughs> is not fit for hunting. Uh, what did it do? Oh, I see you. Jesus, no! God! Oh. Hamish! I got thrown and a bastard hog got me. Take Bill for me, would you? He's a good horse. He may be stubborn, but he's strong. I forgot that's how he died. Hamish? Whoa, oh, that yeah, was close. Uh, we got him, old man. Shite. Take the trophy, giant ball. That was fast. Got the trophy. I don't think we can uh, load Amish or do anything. Normally, I would like probably, I don't know, bury him or something. Swap hat. Yeah, we can get his hat. So here we go. That's how we get okay. Buell. Come on, Buell. Let's go. Now it's ours. So let's have a quick look at his stat. Yeah, five and five. It's not too bad. If we put our saddle on and do syrup and stuff, it can go higher. It can go to eight. I think if we do another race, we can have one more bar of acceleration. Uh, so that could be good. Sad way to get a horse, but we got it. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to the stables to stable Buell, and then we're gonna get our last treasure. But this one is in uh, New Austin. So I'll show you all on the map once we get there. So we made it to north of Crochilla Springs. So that's why we're gonna find a trap. Yeah, it appears on the map anyway. So near rather snake hollow, just over there, there's gonna be a treasure. But to find a place at the beginning, because you're not gonna walk all the way there unless you go for the dinosaur bone, of course. I, I think I'll show you in the satchel. If we go to maps, where are the maps? Letter notes. I don't think it's treasure map. Is it Mende map? Yeah, that's the one. Mende map. That's the two we got, right? And then if we turn over, read. Yeah, the Otis Miller treasure. So you can read all of that if you feel like it. If you flip it again. So that's where we are now. Don't know where we loot. Yeah, north. Not really north. But we're gonna find it now. So it's in a cavern. We just need to climb up. Whoa. Let's go. Okay, apparently not. Oh, it's done there. Oh, come on. Shit. Uh, it was a small jump. I think it's this one. Oh yeah, here you go. Search. So you need to find it to find the drone. So there's like a rotated photograph that we won't look at because I don't think uh, the algorithm on YouTube will like it really. They're not that erotic. They're that erotic from like the back in those days. So they're not too explicit, but. What we want is the gun that we did at some point. Otis Miller revolver. Boom. And I don't think there's anything else in there. So we have a look at it outside. It's a pretty nice gun. Look at that weapon is clean. 
scroll zoom on it. So of course for the Trump and Jump we needed plenty of animals on it. That's how it looks like. Pretty nice. So you don't need I don't hmm. I don't think you need the two maps to find it. It's gonna be there either way. But those are the two maps. We got a while ago. We got them from uh, the Hermit near uh, Annisburg, north of Annisburg, and the one in Beat Valley, the the witch with the dots. And uh, yeah, so that's it. It's not a real treasure map, and it's not a real treasure, but at least you get a ground out of it that you hey, need two hundred percent. So I thought we would do that right now before we get on with uh, the rest of the story mission that we'll go and do next episode. So we're gonna go and see Sadie and uh, get on with the story. So thanks everyone for tuning in, and I'll see you in the next episode. See ya.